Oh, hello again. Back in Donegal. Glen Colin Kill to be precise. Where some Colin Kill come from? Who wrote the famous prophecies? Him and the boys lived here in the 8th century or 6th century or something long ago anyway. Cleaned the whole glen up. Lifted all the stones and set them on top of each other. Set out the beaches. Marked the paths to the roads. Which Donegal County Council would later come along and create for us. So that we could drive our cars with some Japanese guy made for us. Right. There'd be a day. When the boys will be standing at the top of the glen. Talking to each other. On stones. Huh? So that's how the monks describe the iPhone. Anyway, you can't get a signal here, so that prophecy hasn't come true yet. Trying to talk to each other on stones would be a different ballgame, but uh, thank God there's no communication, no internet. So you never know when this could end up back in the net. There's no intention of going anywhere. There's no post office. Well, there's a post office here, but it won't change Her Majesty's pictures into the yo yo. Which is a bit of a problem. Well, it's not actually, it just means you don't die. Uh, don't spend any fucking money, like, you know what I mean? Right. Uh, I would have sent the children across the, over the hill to get us a carry out. We're only out of beer. Eight cans of Carlsberg. Ten fucking euros. You know what I mean? We're getting robbed. But here, no better place to get robbed than die all, let me tell you. I think it's about seven euros for a big bottle of cider, you know what I mean? They're three quid each in Belfast, like. Fuck. No, hardly. Anyway, you're not allowed to smoke in the house. One or two, so one day you're allowed to smoke in the fucking county. So there's a the house, there's a the gate which you lean on to look at the mountain, which is beautiful, and the walls, and there's a the mountain up the back, you can walk right up there to the top, and there's a pile of stones you can sit on, and look across the glen, and there's a the car, Louis we see it. anyway, heaven on earth. So it's time to get with the program, and you can't really get away with from the you can't get away from the program. It's everywhere, even in Donegal, you get it off bloody Ocean FM, who are telling you everything about shootings in Denver, Aurora, and all sorts of mad shit like and Oh, Donegal won the championship yesterday, back to back, 2011 and 2012. Know what I mean? It's a universe of infinite possibilities, and that infinitely possible happens. Anyway, well done, Donegal. Boys were happy last night anyway, and they'll be happy for a while. So the program is end end times. Book a revelation. Know what I mean? We have to fulfil it. Everybody's working on it. It's time that we all got together and said, right now, how do we do it? You know what I mean? Because we're writing the program. In fact, the program is being written into us through movies, through. Everything these fucking Olympics are going to be a program and fucking nightmare. And here, pff, any fucking shit happens to him, you know what I mean? Huh? I was in Donegal. <laughs> Fuck's sake. Anyway, the program is we've got to fulfill the book. So let them bring the Antichrist, let them bring whatever the fuck they want, you know what I mean? Let them bring their aliens down, let them bring any fucking thing. They can bring it on to us, no problems, we can take it for fuck's sake. We're still here. I've been here for fucking thousands and thousands of fucking years. I know, I lived in the Glen before, in a previous life, at least one. Fuck's sake. And here, and, and at night again, you know what I mean? Back home. So, this is it. This is the one we've been waiting for. That's how you know it's the end. We're all here for the end, right? Fuck's sake, it's beautiful. Let's fucking sort it out. We can too. If we believe, you have to have faith. If you had the faith to say of a mustard seed, you could say that mountain, move from here to there, and it would move. Nothing would be impossible for you. 
You know, I mean, fucking simple is that. Like, it's about faith. Faith, we have faith. We've created this fucking whole situation. The oil, right? The oil industry. We manifested fucking petrol out of Mother Earth to fucking run our cars. When really, we should have had the brains to fucking manifest water to run our cars. HHO, separate the hydrogen, burn it in oxygen, bang, exhaust product, water. You know what I mean? Planet coming down, mate. This fucking place is... Coming down with water and you can't drink a trap out of the taps because it puts fluoride in it, the bastards. But it's okay, there's wells here, so we go to a well and get water. Know your water, very important. Uh, no danger of us dying of thirst in Ireland, like, make that starvation. Well, before we get how to fish. Or eat berries and nuts. And all about the fucking laying around us, for God's sake, know what I mean? I must learn what them fucking salad leaves are. There's wild parsley and wild garlic and all sorts of stuff in the glen. But mostly bog, actually. <laughs> That's the way it is, anyway. The dualism, you know what I mean? They're off with the smooth, like the ruggedness of the West here. And the beauty of it at the same time. But fuck, it's hard to live here. Unless you're a fucking millionaire. And we're all millionaires. Unless you manifest it. That's what you have to do create things, like, you know what I mean? Do it without money, too, it's better. You start manifesting things for the Queen, like with pictures of the Queen's head on them, you're uh, giving energy to the Queen, so you don't bother with that crack, like, you know what I mean? Although they're always handy to have pictures of the woman just to remind you who's who and what's what. Oh, there's a guy way past the big, fuck's sake. <laughs> Should have been at the gate to talk to him. That's what we do around here as well. I'm going to walk the clan anyway shortly because the sun's sort of thinking about coming out. And I thought I was dead for three days there. I hadn't seen my shadow. Fuck sick. In the bar though. Anyway, just a few thoughts while I'm sitting still for a few minutes. Like. And you can sit still here for hours and hours and love it. But you can't seem to do that at home. When I'm back in the ghetto in Belfast, I sit in the fucking flat, like, you know what I mean, it's fucking not the same. You're looking outside and it's all fucking flats and houses and all that all around you. Here you're looking out at the rugged glen. Stones, dry stone walls going up. Oh, fucking brilliant, like. So you can chill here a lot handier than you can chill in the city, I must say. And the people are the best in the world, like. The mechanic came around and fixed our Jenny's car the other day. Got it with a hammer. You know what I mean? I'm trying to marry them off to fuck. I'm trying to marry them off to some Donegal farmers. You know what I mean? They could do worse, like. Anyway. Plenty of sheep around here, too. Sheep are the main thing in the economy, like the fields are coming down with. Nine chaps, seven euro fifty for a kilo. What the fuck, like, you know what I mean? That'll cost you twelve quid, like in Tesco's. At least, three of them wee four pound packets, you know what I mean? And their ones are out in there from New Zealand. These would be Donegal lambs. Local, you know what I mean? And I've been stung to death by all sorts of insects and everything. Uh, there are lumps and lumps and lumps and lumps and lumps everywhere, right? There's one on the top of my head somewhere. Uh, right, but that's what happens. You come into the glen and the wee insects have to taste you to see if you're worth consuming. So. I might be worth consuming anyway, they keep consuming me. But I suppose to get a wee sample of you and then that goes into the glen and then after a while you get used to it and you don't come out in the lumps anymore, you know. Theoretically. But in the well there's a big load of insects all hovering around because there's loads of life there and there's frogs hopping about the that size like you know what I mean. They're not the ones you like the back on because I tried it from them. Didn't work. I'm still sensible. Right, anyway. Right, I'm going out to walk a glen, I'll maybe report back later, but I think I'm going to the pub too because I need a bit of human contact. Well, adult human contact. Sensible adult human contact. 
Anyway, we'll see what happens. I guess better being with you can't search hang a thing faster. And she has Gail tagged and she Tell and they need checked over. Mel first, you have a spell you clear, I guess. I checked it, you have a can't search hang a. It's crack more town. I guess not any faster, can I go in and she has. Gail Doggy, faster, not well. Uh, I'm on DVD of it, take a couple of kill of them, what do you think? I guess a uh, package of tobacco, let it hold, mm. uh, cracking, my hoot. Are we like bud? Chief here, Hashkey. I guess Roddy Marsh in. Anyway, just some of the old Gaelic with speaker around here. It's great because the tourists don't understand it and uh, most of us don't, but we sort of know what we're talking about, so it's alright. Anyway, shin the scale. Right, I might come back on, but if I'm drunk, excuse me, but. You never know. Right. Right. Now, way to walk a clean. Take it easy, less. One love. Fruit medley, summer fruits, and even a flat free. And before you think you couldn't get any 